Not there. Try it. Setting up with people, Jesus Christ. Dashing around at the speed of sound. Wrong person to have the character. Yeah, that's a really odd number. I can type relative fast. Go me. The dragons know football. They know the greatest of martial arts. It's not over My yet. Time. But little do they know, I know the exact thing. Committed the best murder. I killed the dinosaurs. Even though those were dragons, they were still dinosaurs in my opinion. Yeah. Uh, lightning support. Fire support. Paralyzing all. Mm, you. Yeah. Da 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 na 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 Everything is wonderful. Everything is awesome. Everything is great. Stab it into the town. That town doesn't deserve to live. Except they totally do. Whoa! You look pretty. You also look very terrifying. Bring it on. I'm not one to shy from a challenge. Oh my god, you're huge! You are huge! Um, well, in that case. Here. It's so big! Uh, that's what she said? Question mark? Eh. I'm alright. 
Oh, really? I can't whistle this all that well. Then again, I can't whistle period, so... <laughs> I believe in you, Tiara. I kinda don't anymore, never mind. Go, I believe. And my parents said if I believe hard enough, I can totally not mess up. You're a jerk. That doesn't really change the fact I still have still more to do. Whee! Let's go. Also, who the hell is in stream right now? is already freezing and we're just standing at the entrance. Oh, score! Someone must have dropped these capes on the floor. They haven't been dropped. It is obvious they were deliberately placed here. Same difference. I'm gonna carve out my fate through sheer willpower, you know? So taking uh -huh. these capes in the name of carving fate will be a piece of cake. What are you talking about? That logic makes no sense at all. Yep. Taking others' possessions is simply inexcusable. What happens if they died? Then it would just be grave robbing, and then people don't use it. If you feel like complaining, you don't need to wear one. Indeed, I will refrain. Hey, she actually learned to shut up like a proper woman. Wow! So Sexist funny. me! Oh, right, because they added an element in this dungeon where you can only use magic or something. Oh, I forgot that was a thing in this game. Oh, it's not because of the thi It's because I'm dumb. I put a stupid thing here. Let's correct that. Better 
off the last time, but this place is still freezing. Mm -hmm. <sighs> it's so cold. I was a lot happier before I walked into this cave. I've never yep. seen such terrible goosebumps. I'm pretty sure I could use them a great ginger. I could really use a warm bowl of udon soup with lots of ginger right about now. Yep. Same here. I don't even want to eat it. Keeping my ass warm. Yeah, I hope so. I I am drawing a mental image of that, and that's not welcome. Well, if you touch your ass, it's not that bad, because your ass is the hottest part of your body. Because she's part of freezer freaking face off. I want it if it meant survival. Uh, you really like to cause problems, don't you? Come on, they are this. Huh? The cape belongs to me now, and I'm letting you borrow it. So there's no problem, right? Your most intriguing thing. His alternative thinking, yes, that's in Any common <laughs> Never mind. I'm I'm saying this as if like I would this write this game. Then again, if I was writing this game, ooh. This game would take how many years to publish? Just on myself. Ooh, it's an undead person. Now, please stay away from me. Please. Thank you. You actually listen. I am impressed. I'm impressed through your via actions. Okay, let's get a roll call in chat. It's me. Someone else, and probably someone else. So cold. Jeez, you catch a cold from letting Tiara borrow your cape. What's the point of giving her the cape in the first place? <sighs> Fine. Here. Ah, I don't think I'll need it. This should warm me up. Uh. Hello. You're big and scary. Time we fought him. No, it's just scripted events. That's true, but it seems you pushed them way too hard. You couldn't withstand the way you fight, Bang. It just doesn't have enough fighting spirit. You should be ashamed of yourself, you lousy fury. That links the fencer to their fairy. It's impossible for you to fight. Please run. I shall hand. There's no way I'm running. You're already worn out. You may be unharmed, but Aaron is grievously wounded. It is a fencer's duty to care for the well. Is Tiara actually worried about me? There's no way I'm going down from that attack. Watch out! No! Aaron! You idiot! Get out of the way! I'll protect you this time, Fang! <laughs> With a certain kick-ass power! 
Hello, Amazing Sauna actually sounds really cool. Is this Aaron's power? Bang! Can you move? My body feels so light. <laughs> I feel like I can fly. Let's do this! Yeah! Combo count plus one fury form is increased in power. And this carries on to New Game Plus mode, which is the best part. So New Game Plus mode is pro. Hear us roar! Care to see my true power? I say, don't stop the kick out of music. Hear us roar! We are Fang and Aaron together, and we make Fang and Fragen. <laughs> That's the best you got. Yes. I just wish the songs were a little more drawn out. Yeah, except that's only for that one cutscene, I'm pretty sure. I can't believe you activated it at exactly the right time. I was so annoyed that Tiara was worried about me that I just powered up. Yes, annoyed. That's the correct word. Which means I am the reason you were able to power up at all. We both owe me sizable life debt. Uh-huh. You're the one who owes me! I saved you, remember? Yes, thanks to me. You said so yourself. So convoluted conversations. I didn't literally say thanks to Tiara, you ingrate. You guys are so damn loud. You may say mean things to each other, but you're still helping each other grow. That's what being friends is all about. No matter your differences or how much you both argue, you help each other out in times of need. Even if you don't want to. about us, but I can't believe how much my nose is running. <laughs> what? Do you admit your faults? Oh, she doesn't admit her faults. Like, that'd be a lot of character improvement. It'll make me feel happy and giddy inside for some reason. Tired and hungry. I'm craving something sweet, actually. Then your wish is granted. Hello, Bachlos, or how you pronounce your name? Look at all these sweets! Did someone summon a dessert genie or what? Well, technically, he looks like a genie. Why, hello there. Sorry to bother you. Hi, Harley. Harley! Pops! Hmm? Why do you know my name? Long story. Ah, uh, well, um. Despite my looks, I'm actually interested in researching fairies, and, um, that's why I know who you are? I see. You're interested. W what Oh, uh, just so we're clear, I'm not stalking you, or anything. You're silly. Of course I don't think you're a stalker. <laughs> She's not the type to get stalkers. You, you, you would think that, but we'll forget up. <laughs> she spends her days locked inside a pigsty of a room doing research and eating junk food. Sounds like me. Anyway, where did you get that cape? 
Oh, I found it earlier. I'm pretty grateful for that, act. I left that cape, but it's all right. You can have it if you want. So, this cape was yours, huh? What were you doing at the Catechus Ice Caves then? Oh, me? I was... It's noisy in here. Did something happen? Yes. Oh, it's Harley and Old Man Bahas. Old Man. Oh my, you know about me too? Hey, I'm not an old man. Yet. Aaron know these people? Yes. This is gonna get complicated, so butt out. Go on, shoo, shoo. Uh, shooing me away like a bothersome insect. Uh. Why does she remind me of a character from Shuffle? Ah, uh, who the, who was the blonde chick? Oh well, if people you know who, who know I Shuffle, am, that makes this easier. I'm Harley, a fairyologist. This is my fairy partner, Bahas. I'm sorry for waiting in your room like this to ambush you. I actually want to ask you for a favor. You want to travel with us? Yeah, sure. Anyway, is it cool if I eat these desserts? You don't mind, right? Thanks for the food! Jump in the gun quite a bit. No fair, Aaron. That one's mine! Uh, it's so delicious! It's the chocolate cake. That, isn't that cake, not custard? Because custard and cake are slightly different. Mm, um, this tiny cake thing is much tastier. Oh, the outside is perfectly cooked, and the inside is overflowing with thick, juicy chocolate. Wouldn't that be a, a tart? Or not a tart. Wow. Wow, I actually know baked goods. How the hell do I not know this? Um... It's not a cookie, but it's a... Uh, it might be a cookie I'm thinking of. Never mind. Hey, you guys! You mustn't eat food that doesn't belong to you without permission! We... And where in the world did you learn to be food critics? That's great to hear. All that baking was worth it just to see your happy faces. Whenever mm -hmm. I cook for Harley, she's never impressed. Unfortunately, I have no sense of taste. Hey, fancy lady, feel free to help yourself. I don't mind. <laughs> I, I, I just now noticed Chewy, like, pawing Tiara. Really? Say! Shut up. Then I shall try some macaroons. Oh. Some macaroons what I... Those are different than, than baked goods, aren't they? No. How are they? Amazing! It tastes so delicious! As if my stomach has been reunited with an old friend! Well, sir, I'm quite picky about what goes in my dishes, and I go out of my way to not use harmful ingredients. Uh-huh. Really? I didn't know that. What? Really? Gee, mm, you don't know what you're missing. Oh, oh man, it's so Well, didn't good. she literally just say she had no sense of taste? Like, literal sense of taste, so her her nerves and her tongue are gone. Yep, yep. I totally wouldn't mind repeating this moment over and over again. It's strange, though. Whatever happened to Dorcas dinner party? Man, you're so rude. <clears throat> You think about food all the time. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I mean. And you're also one to say. We met Harley after we met Lord Sherman at Dorfus' party. Oh yeah, that's right. Tiara, have you received an invitation to a party from the uh, Dorfa Corporation? No, I haven't received any invitation. I heard the party Dorfa was planning to throw got canceled. What do you mean? There's only one explanation I can think of. The exact moment we traveled back in time became the singularity. Because of that, the past events leading up to that singularity are beginning to change. <sighs> yep. Sorry to interrupt, but is it alright if I explain what I'm doing here? Sure. Talking's free, so talk away. <laughs> Thanks. 
Apparently, there's a fury at the Zawaza Plains, but it's being guarded by one of Dorothy's <gasps> executives. <laughs> Zawaza Plains. She must be talking about Apollonius. Yep. You know about him, too? Jeez, you guys have good connections. Well, I've said pretty much everything I want to say. Let's all team up so we can collect that fury. Okay. Why do I have to do that? Just don't Fast kill days. him. We'll do it. We must cross this unavoidable path if we are going to revive the god. Eh, I knew this was going to happen. I don't mind going to the Zawaza Plains, but what's your deal, Harley? You're not doing this just out of kindness, right? I'm a fencer, too. Dorfa looks like they're up to no good, so I'd rather see you kids collect the Furies. For the sake of world peace and all that. Mm -hmm. Of course, that's not entirely accurate, either. You guys were at the Catechus Ice Cave yesterday. Yeah? That scared the loon piss out of me. Uh, versus I have okay. a device for measuring the energy output of fairies, and it recently recorded an unprecedented amount of energy. I was interested in finding out what kind of fairy could produce such power, so I went searching for the one responsible. Is that? Yes, it was you. Talking about one thing when I returned to the past. Yep. By coincidence, I saw you guys coming just as I was planning to investigate inside the Catechus Ice Cave. I'd never seen your faces before, so my curiosity was piqued. Mm -hmm. Shortly after, my device recorded another demonstration. Also, of can yet again, can we get a roll call at all? Anyone listening? Caring? Your device must have recorded the moment Aaron's power forced the broken fury to evolve. Evolve, huh? That's very interesting. The reading wasn't as big as the one from the other day, but it, I got even more curious about what kind of fairy could produce such energy. So I followed after you guys, and that led me here to this inn. Also, just think of those capes of yours as my way of helping you out. You didn't seem dressed for the season. Wow, that was nice of you. <laughs> you know, now that I think about it, does that mean you were stalking us the whole time? Yes, but she's also a helpful stalker. <sighs> I'd say that's typical Harley behavior, but I'm a little scared. She's just interested in me, right? <laughs> Come here. Much. For some reason, her eyes seem way scarier than they did before. Well, that's just some people. Like, you can't All really aside, judge them. I just want to study that fairy's power up close. Honestly, I don't really care about world peace or doing what's right. Would you mind if someone like me tagged along with you? Not really. Just know you could hold yourself in a fight. Not at all. Um, how should I put this? I'm already used to it. If Fang okays it, then I guess it's settled. Thanks. I'm happy to hear that. Uh -huh. It's refreshing to see enthusiastic eaters for a chain. I'll make sure to feed you guys plenty during our journey. Okay, cool. For sure. I hope we get along, Pops. We need to be careful if we're gonna go up against Dorfa. Anyway, what's your fairy's name, Thing? Aaron. Aaron, huh? It'd be bad if something happened to you. I'd better thoroughly examine that pretty body of yours. Harley, you were fairly scary. Hey! It's your dirty hands off me! They were dirty to begin with? You're very interesting, Aaron. You're gonna have to show me how deep this rabbit hole goes. Run. Just, just run. Save yourself. No! Get away from me, you black! That's one way to say it. This has certainly taken a turn for the bazaar. For the bazaar. Bazaar. Bazir. He's only gonna experiment on Aaron, though. We still get to enjoy Bajas' free food. My condolences, Aaron. I wish I had food. Hey, ah, Harley. Everybody do the Harley. <laughs> Everyone do the Harley. Let's, let's not make that into a meme, shall we? Oh, I wish I modeled my hair. Like, as as weird as it is gonna sound, I have more hair of like Harley than anyone. I wish I modeled my hair like fans. That would look also really bad on me, honestly, if you're judging hair wise. What? I'm fine. You got food? You got food? 
Well, I clean your dirty ass kitchen.
Okay. Let's make this interesting. What? My turn. New data. Get ready. These elves calling out. My help. I'm ready. New data. We level up. Level up. Okay. So not bad. Okay. So we actually have more than enough money I want to ever want to really need in this game. But hey, more money doesn't hurt. Sucker. Keep calm. Yay! I forgot that's a trophy. SP reduced cost by remaining calm and attention engages. Ooh, that's not that bad, really. So we are going to say screw everything and run the best way. Play your game, video game. New 
Jada. Ridiculous bomb. Yep. Food is quite glorious. Mark Zuckerberg. Hey, we got to the 20th floor. Iron Emblem. Whee! We are big. You're really big. You're really, really, really big, apparently. Holy crap. Crap and baloney. Baloney crap. Increase idle. Take poison. You're not even susceptible. You are susceptible. What? I thought most bosses weren't susceptible to poison. Uh, can I stop you? What? I thought bosses weren't susceptible to this stuff. Okay, apparently I'm just full of it, apparently. You know what? Sure. You suck. Here we go. I'm ready. New data.
Data. You know what, you really don't focus on the second one, so... My turn. New data! Fire! Get ready! My turn! Here we go! Get ready! Getting the Iron Emblem, we get another Fury. It's a B rank. Nice. Oh, it's a heart. What? You get that from this? Uh, show us how much Iron. Remember this game, honestly. Okay, now let's screw up the entire everything! Prepare yourself! I'm ready! Here we go! Let's do this! I'm ready! New data! Okay.
Tetsu's tower, yay. Let's go. My turn. Here we go. Get ready. Need that. I'm ready. My Here we go. Let's do this. New data. New data. New data. I'm ready. My time is wasted. New data. Go. My time. Let's do this. Bad. I'm ready! Hit for the booty to his bed! Run the way! Let's do this! New data! My turn! Get ready! Here we go! I gotta stop being a stupid button. Data. 
data. Get ready. My turn. Here we go. My turn. Oh no! 
this over with. I want to get back to the inn and eat Bajas' home-cooked food. Sure thing. What do you feel like eating? Uh, let's see. Maybe a juicy steak? Oh, no. An omelet sounds good, too. Ha! <laughs> Child's play. Choose something that's actually challenging to cook. I would like a mushroom and cheese risotto. Ah, risotto? I can't fill up on that watery gruel. Right, Aaron? I'm not picky. Hey, you seem down in the dumps. Aren't you excited for food? You can't really get an energetic response in this kind of situation. Yep, your body temperature is perfectly normal. Your muscles and skeletal structure are also typical of humanoid fairies. Can you tell me again how it felt when your broken fury evolved? Was there a ringing in your ear? Or a loud gong sound? Did you get aroused? Were you praying at the time? Feel any side effects? Also, you said you only have fragments of your missing memories. Can you tell me what triggered getting those fragments back? I... been at this for a while. I'm starting to feel sorry for Aaron.
over yet. Can't see uh. my true power. Next. That was nothing. temporary disciple after I got tired of saving him all the time. What are you talking about? He was always saving your butt from trouble. Um, who is this Lord Sherman? You haven't met him yet, but Lord Sherman is an extremely handsome fencer brimming with love and justice. He's sensitive, kind, and oh so strong. His mouth whispers sweet songs and his fingers make the most beautiful music. He's the perfect man. A white knight valiantly riding his noble steed. <sighs> That's stupid. You're stupid. I do not fully understand. But he sounds like he's the complete opposite of Fang. That's right. He's nothing like Fang. Yeah, yeah. Jeez. How many times am I going to have to listen to this crap?
Since Apollonius is waiting just up ahead, I want to hold a quick strategy meeting and discuss what's going to happen next. What do you mean? I'm going to try and recruit Apollonius to my team. That's a fun idea, but why do you want to do that? I've decided that I'm not going to kill my enemies anymore. I never want to kill another person ever again. Fang? Are you doing this for Emily? Fang? He'll fall to his knees once he sees how awesome I am. And then, I'll just force him to hand over the Fury. After that, I'm gonna make him join my team, so he can help us collect the Furies. We'll be that much closer to reviving the Goddess, and he won't have to die. It's like killing two birds with one stone. Um... Isn't that a little impossible? The notion that you're somehow awesome is patently ludicrous. All right, strategy meeting adjourned. It's go time. Hey, hey, think this through. Apollonius! Who goes there? Why do you know my name? Are you supposed to be fencers? Whoa, hold it. Time out. I don't want to fight you. You just hand over your fury like a good boy. I'm willing to make you my top disciple. Oh, no. Really doing it. Working for me is way better than working for a stuffy corporation like Dorfa. You won't have to wake up early in the morning, and no one will hassle you if you feel like sleeping all day either. You will have to kill some monsters here and there, but other than that, it's a pretty cushy gig. Bajas here will even feed you. What do you think? Great offer, huh? Only Fang would think that is a great offer. I have never been more disrespected in my entire life. Whoa! Hey! Were you listening to me? I don't... I've devoted my life to swordsmanship, to cleanse my soul of all earthly desires, and walk the path toward true enlightenment. There is no greater disrespect than being compared to a savage, ignorant human. Why are you being so selfish? Swords and battling aren't that important. There are people who will cry if you die, you know? That does not concern me. My sword is my own... You... Until I've avenged my brother's death, my journey will never end. Don't play dumb! You have a little sister! Don't you care about Emily's feelings? How do you know about... No. I do not have a little sister. I severed those ties the day I poured my soul into this blade. You idiot! I'll show you just how empty your selfish words really are! Out of my way! Brace yourself. I'm ready! Here we go! Get ready! Let us be I'm ready! New data? Let's do this! Let us begin! I'm ready! New data? Get ready! Let us begin! Here we go! I'm ready! It's not over yet! Let us begin! My turn! New data? that you're wrong so how about it are you gonna join fang's side now kill me huh kill me defeat means death to a warrior i would rather die than receive mercy from an stop being so stubborn dying won't make anyone happy don't you have someone you need to stay alive to protect enough 
Your commitment is admirable. I shall redeem your soul. Stop! <clears throat> Apollonius! Hey! Get a hold of yourself! You can't die! Damn it! Why did this happen? This isn't gonna change anything! Save your tears. He was a threat to this world from the very beginning. Yeah. I once thought that about him too. But I can't. You are too naive, Fang. Once a human is tainted by evil, they will never change. It is my duty to eradicate those defects. Wait, do you recognize? Of course. I travel through time with the two of you. Yep, this is where the story kind of becomes. This phenomenon was most likely caused by your fairy partner, yes. Oh, yes, but why are you... Remember Lord Sherman, he was never of such a power like this. Tiara, I am grateful to you. Thanks to you, I was able to discard my innocence. Now nothing will lead me astray. I will never forgive the vile god. That is the evil that stole my family. What happened to him? Apollonius! Let me see. You're right. He's still breathing, but he's losing blood fast. Isn't there any way we can save him? He'll succumb to his wounds before we can get him to a finish. But I recall hearing about a fairy flower in the Rudoke Blast Furnace that can heal any wound instantly. Got it. Just sit up. The fairy flower has no effect on the dead. You had best run while he's still. Yeah. Harley, you and Baja stay with Apollonius. Me, Aaron, and Tiara will head over. All right. Here's unst Understood. <laughs> Whoa there! Jeez, I can't take my eyes off. You safe? Let's hurry. You are actually serious about this. I never took you for someone who would work this hard to save anyone's life. Much. I fought Apollonius before in my timeline and killed him. 
At the time, I told myself that I only did what... But then, I met Apollonius's little sister afterward. She told me she was on a journey to adventure... Apollonius was whispering her name earlier. I'm not going to let anyone die anymore. Death isn't just a tragedy, it's a chain reaction that screws up everyone around. So that is what happened. Plus, if I let Apollonius die here, I won't be able to save... I'll just repeat the same fate as before. You know, Aaron said that Sherman person was brimming with love and justice, but his ap... He was a much kinder person before we were tossed into the past. I can't believe he got sent into the past like... But still, why did he ch... Wait, the fairy flower! That's it! All right, let's grab it and her... Flower to... Flowers all withered. That monster's poison must have tried it up. What do I do? I can't save Apollonius with this. Damn it! Hey. Emily's gonna lose her brother again. Wait, Emily. Bang! I like you. my brother is a warrior, and I gave that to him just in case he ever got wounded. But he said he didn't need it. The amulet that Emily gave me! This is bad. The bleeding isn't stopped. His wound just barely missed his heart. He'd already be dead if it wasn't for... We should be grateful that Fang charged at his assailant before he could complete his attack. But if we don't do something about this wound... Goodness. He's still breathing. Tilt his head. I need him to drink it. Oh, you're awake now. I hope you're feeling grateful. Up. From now on, your life belongs to me. Don't go losing it without my permission. I even made sure to write my name on it. Before I lost consciousness, I heard you were going to the Rudoke Blast Furnace. Seems that wasn't a hallucination. No need to thank us. Just serve us well. Fight me. No matter how many times you spare my life, I will not falter from this court. 
Betraying Dorfa and allying with my enemies is out of the question. As long as I still draw breath, I will point my sword at you. Did you stop? Your words are meaningless. A golden opportunity. Brace yourself. I'm ready. Let's do this. New data. Let us begin. I'm ready. Here we go. Get ready. Brace yourself. New data. My turn. Get ready. Let us begin. Here we go. My turn. Get ready. I never expected you to be. This, if this persists, my honor will be sullied. I must risk it all on this single blow. New data. I'm ready. Let's do this. Brace yourself. Here we go. I'm ready. Brace yourself. Let's do this. New data. I'm ready. This is nothing. Get ready. Here we go. I'm ready. Know your New place. data. You're a real pain in the ass for attacking me. It seems I've lost. Let's run. We gotta get out of here before Apollonius gets up. I didn't mortally wound him, so he'll recover soon enough. Let us flee before we are forced to fight yet another battle. Next time I see you, I'll definitely make you join my party. You better watch your back till then. Are you trying to sound threatening? Let's go. What an amusing young man. Still, a loss is a loss. Only cowards stay alive after suffering to... <laughs> Emily, I hope you find happiness. Yep, that doesn't happen to me possible. into that guy in my timeline, but I'm sure things will still be okay. Don't you think so? After all, I'm Fang the Fearless! Whoosh! What was that push noise for? Uh, don't worry about it. Now then, let's head over to Solaru Village. I'm gonna go get some drink. I need some...
Remember this place so fondly. It'll be fine. I mean, we defeated him before, remember? Idiot! It seems you've forgotten that I'm actually a G. Huh? What? Why bother fighting some annoying battles? I'm just gonna make this short and sweet. I remember that the Fury should be inside the villages. So, we'll just sneak into the dungeon, steal the Fury, and avoid fighting Zank at all? You're right! That's a much better idea than confronting him head on. I'm impressed, Fang. Yeah, so, Aaron, go search for the dungeon. What are you doing? Fight! Risk everything in a glorious fight to the death! I'll spare the victor's life! Please, don't. We'd never do that. We're brothers! Idiots! That's why it's so hilarious! Man, you're both pissing me off! If you care about brotherly love so much, then just... Fools! <laughs> Can no one entertain me? <laughs> Thanks, Snap! Snap, snap, snap! More snapping! Snap, snap, snap! Snap, snap! <sighs> That's enough, Zenk. What? Are you seriously giving me orders, huh, Paiga? Did you forget that I technically outrank you? So what? You got a problem with my methods? No, 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 not at all. However, it might be best if you tried a more amicable approach. Shut the hell up! What do you care, anyway? We've got the Fury. Quit! No, that's not it, but... 
Please, you must come. We need to collect the Furies in secret, and we especially can't risk damaging Dwarfa's reputation. Our stock would fall drastically. We'd lose all public trust, and once that happens, we could kiss our year-end bonuses goodbye. If that happens, how am I supposed to pay my mortgage, my daughter's tuition, or my bar tab? Wow, I'm impressed. You're such a hot... Shut up! You be quiet! Did you just tell me to shut up? Are you volunteering to help me relieve some stress? N -n not at all. I was talking to Vivian. <clears throat> More importantly, where did you put the Fury? <clears throat> Don't worry about it. I stuck it in the dungeon for safety. I'm back! We pretty much found out where we need to go. It looks like there are a lot of guards on duty, but as long as we navigate carefully, I'm sure it'll be a... Let's try to avoid any unnecessary... Not gonna happen to me. The Fury should be down the staircase. Something free? Huh? It's not me. I take baths every day. Me, you're smelling tea. I bathe every day as well. No, it's not that. Something smells really bad. As in corpses. It smells coming from the school. Ugh. Dead bodies. Is this a grave? No. Well, what is it, Fang? Don't come here. Don't even look here. This must be Zink's doing. Such cruelty from a fencer is unforgivable. I'm a kitchen. I'm a chicken from the kitchen. Blah, 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 blah. The dungeon is all the way at the back, but there's a guard standing watch. What should we? Even if we're sneaking in, some fights are just unavoidable. Yeah, fairy link. Are you ready? Come. New data. Let's do this. Slash. Stay down. Possible. You should have backed down. I've become strong. <gasps> this smell like. Found it. Bang. Pip. Stop right there. Someone who's defeated you once before. Let me give you some free advice. If you fight me, you're definitely good. Just back off and hand over the fury like. You sounded really impressive, but... Really? <clears throat> then let me. I will one day bring peace to this world, and everyone will call me a legendary. People all over the world will shower me with money and gifts. Is that what you really want? Hush! I was just kidding. Looks like you've got some hot babes with you, too. If I win, you've got to hand those women over to me. That's fine with me. Hey, Bing! You can't make a decision like that without my permission. My life and my fury... There's no way I'm gonna lose. From now on, just call me Fang the Fearsome. Huh? Harley? Please? Uh, I'm pretty sure Fang can handle this. Things seem to work out for him somehow. I'm okay with it too. My life is already in Finn's hands. What's going on? Why am I the outcast now? Very well. I suppose. Please do your best, Finn. Yeah, leave it to me. You got. Okay, Finn. Come, Della. Fair eyes. Yay! 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 Use this! 
Thanks! Sorry to break this to you, Zank, but there'll be no bloody rain today. Just sunshine and clear... Oh, Genie. Another Nepal thing.
data. Let's do this. Ooh. I'm ready. Here we go.
data. Let's do this next. We should have backed down. It looks like that worked. I'm ready. Get ready.
New data. I'm ready. Here we go. Let's do this. My turn. New data. Time to show off. Stay down. Now it's nothing.
Don't count me out. Who wants to die? Let's do this. Who wants to die? Don't count me out. Who wants to die? One of them. Let's do this. Who wants to die? Get ready. Who wants to die? Get ready. Who wants to die? Get ready. Let's do this. Get ready. Who wants to die? Get ready. Who wants to die? Not yet. Let's do this. Who wants to die? Get ready. Who wants to die? Yet. Who wants to die? Get ready. Who wants to die? Let's do this. Who wants to die? Let's do this. You better be ready. That is. I hope you're ready to. Let's do this. Who wants to die? Damn it. Who wants to die? Who's next? Oh god damn it. Why the hell? Let's make this interesting. My turn. Get ready. Here we go. Here we go. I'm ready. Next. I'm ready.
My turn. Get ready. New data.
I forgot how hard your fight was. A new power. Fang, you suck. Join my party. No one's ever said that to me before. Are you sure about this? I mean, look who you're asking. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, hey, Fang. I know you're merciful and all, but isn't this a bit much? Did you forget about that mass grave he filled? That's right. I object to this as well. There's no way I am going to let a savage beast like... Right, Aaron? Hmm. I've heard that days of training is all it takes to make a stray dog loyal. I don't want to be near him for three of many... <laughs> You've left yourself... Look out, eh? <laughs> you... Godo... Are you... <coughs> really betraying me? Huh, this ain't betrayal. It's justice. You're a heartless monster. I've been waiting a long time to do! Goldo, am I really dead? Hey, Skaldo. How do you know my name, eh? They just said it. Oh, I got it. You and me must be bound by the string of destiny, eh? Oh, I'm so touched. You get it now, Fang? Some people are just rotten to their core. I know it's not easy to hear, but you need to accept that. I know, but even if the odds were slim, Still, I can't change fate if I don't try with all my heart. That's why I... Boy, that's a real great thing to say. You're a man after my own heart. From now on, I'm gonna... Yeah, I know. You're our friend. Come, join us. What are you doing here, Fang? It's almost dinner time. I'm not hungry. Are you kidding me? You, of all people, aren't hungry? Are you feeling okay? Shut up. Leave me alone. I'm guessing you still feel bad about Zank, right? Not really. Don't beat yourself up over it. You took a risk on another person's feelings. Who cares if you lost this time? As long as you keep taking that risk with others, it'll eventually pay off. Bahas is making us famous beef stew for dinner. Are you sure you don't want it? I can eat. Lord Sherman, I presume. It's a pleasure. So, uh, you're the same Lord Sherman who's famous for being the most powerful fencer in the land, right? No need to shout. I can hear you just fine. Now state your business. 
pardon me. My name is Paiga, and I'm here on behalf of the Dorfa Corporation. The reason I'm here is because I have been sent to scout you for an executive position within the company. To be frank, we'd like you to lend us your power. Please, please don't say no. I won't get my year-end bonus if you do. Aw, oh, man, you were way too honest with him. You're an adult, right? Don't you know how to keep your true intentions to yourself? Zenk was defeated, and the fury he was supposed to deliver was stolen. I'm at my wit's end here. There's no way I'm going back to Dorfa empty-handed. Don't you understand the position? Oh, I understand. You're just desperate to save your... Very well. Please grant me an audience with your superiors. Y yes of course. Gladly. Please excuse me while I contact the company. Ah, Mr. President? I just finished scouting some promising new talent. What happened to Zank? Uh, well, uh, he was actually defeated by some sneaky little boy named... <laughs> I, I understand your anger, sir, but Zank was a total turd compared to this new fencer. Please don't fire me! Hmm. Right this way, Lord Sherman. The President is expecting you. So you must be this Sherman fellow I've heard so much about. With your help, our company will be that much. Soon, the vile god will be revived, and the world will be... I want you to serve me as I usher in a new era. After the vile god's resurrection, I will become this world's new... I serve no one. Did something happen? What is the... There's only one person who's worthy of becoming a host for the vile god. Me. Oh, I see. Well, you certainly made a convincing argument. It seems there are those among Dorfa's ranks who possess the wisdom to see my potential. Hanagata has been recalled. And now we shall serve our new leader. Bernard? What are you... Do not hesitate now. This is proof that Hanagata was unworthy. The Dorfa Corporation welcomes our new leader with open arms. We shall read. I will become this world's god. Only then will true salvation come. Wait just a moment. You'll have to fill out the necessary paperwork, or it could cause all kinds of trouble later. I'll go prepare the contract right now. Are you okay with this? The more pawns, the better. I'm sure he'll prove useful. Okay, two hours is decent enough after... Oh my god, that boss fight which was bull. But tomorrow I should be able to make some more progress. We're at 421, I think, aren't we?
Okay, let's uh, stop because, oh my god, this game is really long. And also, we have just hit 10 hours. Oh, god. I need